Prince William loves the normal of Kate Middleton. Kate's upbringing was far removed from life as heir to the throne. Prince William may have grown up surrounded by all the comforts of Buckingham Palace, but according to friends, he loves that Kate Middleton's childhood was so different from his own, and he now accepts those differences as they raise their children together and separately at the palace. According to sources, Kate's non-royal parentage and has given children, namely Prince George, Princess Charlotte and Prince Louis, the opportunity to get dirty, play and be kids. These children seem quite content with life, a source close to the royal family said. It's a lot of the stabilizing normalcy that Kate brings, and that's how she's grown up. William loves it. She comes from a diverse background and knows how important it is to spend time with her family, added a second source. She didn't grow up in that aristocratic environment where you see kids every day for a short time. Describing her childhood during a 2020 interview with the Happy Mum, Happy Baby podcast, Kate said, I'm in the country with my family, and we're all dirty. Royal fans will know that grew up in Buckleberry, a small village, and spoke of her time bouldering in the Lake District as a child. Members of the royal family haven't had a chance to get those foundations right for generations, but they did, the friend added, reports People. Another way for Kate to keep her kids as close to reality as possible is to drive them to school and make sure she or Prince William are home when they come back in the afternoon. And of course, Kate was open about how much she loved cooking for her family and the kids and sharing her love of the outdoors with everyone. What Prince William likes most about Kate Middleton is her normality, which shows Kate Middleton's roots, and Prince William loves her. Thanks to her non-royal upbringing, the Princess of Wales has brought a healthy dose of normality to the lives of the couple's heirs and children, Prince George, Princess Charlotte and Prince Louis, a People Palace source has said. These guys seem pretty happy with their lives, the source said. It's much of the stabilizing normalcy that Kate brings, and that's how she was raised. According to a source, Middleton, who grew up in the village of Buckleberry, is determined to give her children a chance at a normal childhood. Growing up in the country, Middleton loved the great outdoors and a bit of chaos. She revealed on the Happy Mum, Happy Baby podcast in 2020 that she's happiest when I'm in the country with my family and we're all dirty. Driving kids to school isn't uncommon, either. Middleton even assures that she or Prince William will be home when she returns. She reportedly values every time she spends with her family. She didn't grow up in that aristocratic environment where you see the kids a little bit every day, the source explained. Prince William and Duchess Kate, as well as Prince George, do not forget that they are raising the future monarch. Prince George, who turns 10 on July 22, seems aware that he comes second. He spent some time alone with Queen Elizabeth and Prince Philip before their deaths in, even engaging in a formal conversation about his duties in 2020. Duties that went beyond the requirements of the royal family, he made a conscious effort to provide children with a normal education allow, the source said dot members of the royal family haven't had a chance to get this foundation right for generations, but they have, said a friend of the couple.